What's up guys, Charles from Team Blackjack here, bringing you my prediction for this upcoming ban list for October 2019. So starting off with cards I think should get banned are Nightmare Mermaid and Guard Dragon Army Pain. Um, Nightmare Mermaid, Orcus has been the best deck for quite some time. Uh, Orcus Soup has been a thing for quite some time. Come on, it's time for just to move on, rotate the format. Um, yeah, that's all that there is for that. Orcus has just been a really good deck for a decent amount of time to the point where we should be rotating away from uh, Orcus Soup at this point. Uh, Guard Dragon Argapan. Argapan brings out a free body from the extra deck. It's a free negate free body, and that's kind of, not kind of, but you, that should have pretty good. So, uh, get rid of it. Uh, cards, I think, should get limited. Uh, so starting off, let's talk about Sky Strike for a little bit. So Sky Strike has been tier one for almost two years, and that's I find that to be an issue. I'm tired of seeing the same deck topping events for almost two years. I like I want at this point I want to see a lot of different things. Sky Strikers evolve multiple different formats, and it's time for a change. Now I don't think they need to get new. I don't think they need to be unplayable. I just think they need to get hit. So they're they're like a tier three, tier two ish, tier two three ish deck. So. Um, I think Widow Anchor is the only real hit the deck needs to that. Uh, since most decks, the main issue that they're dealing with is they can't deal with multiple Widow Anchors, multiple hand traps, such and such. And uh, I guess while we're on the topic, well, we'll get there. Uh, Mystic Mind. Cards to me at three. Jesus up wins that people don't deserve, lets you stall. Punish your opponent for playing the game. Put it to one. Uh, double Iris Magician. Now that's, uh, those of you that have played Pendulum format knows how good the Pendulum Graph cards are. But um, if we're getting rid of the Guard Dragon engines, which right now mostly Pendulums are using, I think it's okay for us to give them back something that uh, they had before in the form of Double Iris, the Pendulum Graph cards, you know, just on that. Um, Heavy Storm Duster. It can come to one, especially because of the new card coming out that combines Storm Duster and Dragecki. There's no reason for us not to have actual Feather Duster, especially since the OCG has it at one. Colossus. Colossus should go to one, but mostly because right now in the OCG, Thunder is the best deck and they have Colossus to one. Imagine right now here, if we had a ban list that was very similar to the OCG, but Col uh, Thunder Dragons wasn't touched. It would take a large chunk of the meta so the Colossus should go to one because of that um pot of average should go to one i say that for two reasons one is because they have it in the ocg but the other reason is because of zodiacs so i think the zodiac giant can come to one uh and the reason i say this is giant is just a pop the deck itself is inherently bad without broadball without a main way to search your cards you know, just Broadbow is a reason why the deck plus so hard, and without Broadbow, the deck isn't as strong. So Dryden in itself won't do anything. Even three, I don't even think three Dryden will do anything. But like just to test, Konami should bring it to one. Uh, Karsha should come to two. Zodiac Rap. If Dryden's gonna come to one, bring Rap to two. Zoo hasn't done anything. I also say Zoo because of kind of because of Orcus. Because I want Orcus to be rotated out, I want other things to be rotated in. I don't see anything wrong. Konami hasn't given us a tier 1 deck since Salamangri, which yeah, wasn't that long ago, but I think if you're not going to give us any tier 1 decks anytime soon, which seems to be the case from what's been announced, go ahead and just give us cards off the ban list to give us other competitively viable decks. And next card I think should be at the 2 is... Sky Striker, Mobilize, Engage. I'm not gonna stretch on that. I've already talked about that uh, in terms of Widow Anchor. Engage to two, arguably to one, but I think two is fine. Uh, and lastly, Salam and Great Circle. In the OCG, they have Circle at three. Zuka. Salad doesn't do anything too crazy. It's in their meta, but it's not, it's not like just tearing it up. And they also have Lady Debug at two. We have Debug at one. So I think, I think freeing up Salad a little bit won't cause any major issues probably be much healthier for the meta. Cards to three, this is a long list. First and foremost, um, Construct. Construct number three just because of the 
structure deck that's coming out in December. Now, I don't know if it'll come to be this list. They might wait for the next list when we actually get the structure decks. Regardless, it's going back to three. I don't see anything wrong with them. Just bring them bringing it back to three right now. But we'll see what Commander decides. Uh, performance damage juggler. It's still on the. It's not at three. I think. What is it? At one? I can't remember. But it's not at three. And I think they can come to three. Uh, Ether, bring to 3 Monarchs aren't going to do anything on that same note. Pantheism to 3 Monarchs aren't going to do anything. Uh, Insector Dragonfly, Light Stage, it was only hit because of Orcus, so if we're going to ban Mermaid, Light Stage can easily come back. Uh, Book of Mood to 3, Ulti Cannon Hawk, I don't see why that's still on the list. It is almost laughable at this point. Uh, Dang Long can come back, and I say Dang Long because uh, Miko. So, Miko isn't doing anything too crazy in this meta right now. It's not really, I don't think it's actually doing anything at all. I don't know if Dragon Link is still a deck. I'm pretty sure it is, but it's not really doing, like, it's not tier 1. So, on that note, I'm pretty sure Dang Luck can come back without major changes to the meta. Unless Konami gives us something in the future. Maybe in the form of Needle Fiber. Who knows? We'll see. Oh, last two. Sure it to 3, because... Well, it's at two right now, bring it to three. But Necro is a unicorn of three. And I say this because the main issue with Necro is recursion. Necro has a difficult time playing out grind games without their main source of recursion in the form of unicorn. So I think they can bring it that back. And you could say, well, unicorn is really good since it face negates face up extra deck monsters. I don't think that's a big deal because we have cards like Impermanence, Chalice. Uh, we have kaijus, there's so many ways to get rid of uh, the one problematic monster, because that's really going to be the one problematic monster, unless something like uh, general release or rituals come back, and even then I'm not even sure Necros would be like that good in a sense. With that being said, yeah that's about it, that's all I got. Um, let's trust with Team Blackjack, I'll see you later. Uh, if you like what you hear, please like the video, comment, subscribe, share this. So let other people know, just help us. Uh, yeah, see y'all later.